competing and what does it take and what to expect and all the side effects from competing. First of all, I'm going to talk about the side effect I hate the worst is not getting enough sleep. Um, countless nights where you're tossing and turning. It's just a part of the diet and the prep process. I mean, you're just tired all the time. Um, number two, stomach upset. Most people's stomach hurts all the time. They get gas, they get bloated because you're eating so much food and protein. I would suggest um, taking a good probiotic. Also taking, I'm sure people see plenty of videos, but taking your apple cider vinegar, the Bragg's kind. Um, when I'm prepping still, uh, during my whole prep, I do things a little differently than some people. I have a very fast metabolism. So after my um, workout, I will do um, uh, 60 grams of whey protein isolate, hydro whey, right after my workout. I'll wait about 15 minutes, and then I'll do a Gatorade, probably about 16 to 20 ounces, with five to 10 milligrams of creatine. And that just fills my muscles up nicely. And also another thing I do, oops, is um, my amino acids. My DB Army full effect. I do those um, about four times a day. And that keeps me very, very full um, on my prep. Another arsenal on my prep is I do my Seromax. Um, I sell it on my website. It has HGH effects. It makes you full. It makes you hard. So when I'm on it, I'm super hard vascular all the time. Um, all my clients love it. I love it. Um, so basically, some other downfalls of, of competing. I mean, you're suffering. You're hurting. You're tired all the time. If you're doing things right, um, you're not going to feel good. Can, people can complain all the time. Well, I don't feel good. Something must be wrong. Or, you know, no, no, nothing's wrong. It's just part of the process. Another thing is, coach, I'm flat. I'm flat. Uh, I need more carbs. I'm flat. No, you're not fat. You're, we're, you were flat, fat, and now we're bringing you down. All that matters is what you look like on show day. So if you're flat, 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 and two days before the show, you look in the mirror, you're like, oh, I don't have any veins. I'm not full. You're, you carve up for two days, and you're like, Phew. And it's a complete night and day. And some of my athletes and myself, I carve up very, very heavy. And, um, you know, your body changes. It's like night and day within a couple couple days. Um, another is just to, everything you have to take. All the vitamins, all the pills. And, uh, you know, I'm a believer in supplements. And um, I think you need them. And just swallowing all the pills, taking all the supplements is a hassle to a lot of people. Um, another part is in the kitchen, right here, the pots and the pans, always cooking. It's a part of it, you live in the kitchen, you're eating, you're sleeping, you're in the bathroom, you're training, you're doing your cardio, if you have to do cardio. Luckily, I don't have to do cardio. But, you know, you know, cooking, a lot of times people have a spouse or girlfriend that will cook for them. And, you know, be appreciative for those people because that makes it a lot easier um, when it comes to prep time. But um, anyways, I'm repping my new Gorilla Wear uh, tank and shorts. You can't really see them right now. I love this bodybuilder wear. It fits perfect for a bodybuilder. It's not baggy in the end. It's, you know, it's full at the top. And so um, that's pretty much it. Um, I'm about to eat some of my favorite ice cream which is Arctic Zero. I'm not prepping now, but it's a pretty, you know, decent ice cream that doesn't mess my stomach up. Like, uh, I think Halo, a lot of people try Halo as a healthier ice cream and that tears my stomach up. Have any questions or comments or anything to say or ask, um, just leave comments below. But like I said, um, prepping for a show is fun and the aspect it, that is, is a big challenge but you're not gonna feel good all the time it's gonna hurt you're gonna have you're gonna be grouchy your body is not getting everything it needs your body is not supposed to be 250 pounds with 3% body fat um, so that time the time that you are and you're getting there you're gonna hurt for myself I'll speak for myself and a lot of clients since I'm a big prep coach all my joints hurt all the time my feet hurt all the time I feel like I'm 80 years old when I get out of bed so a lot of people just see these bodybuilders and they don't see like all the hard work 
that goes into it. So don't think that, you know, it's all roses and sunshine because it is a lot of work and a lot of pain and a lot of suffering to get on stage for a couple minutes to win a plastic trophy. So you have to be passionate about this hobby. And I kind of want to take a toll out there. Um, my trophies are all boxed up in a box. And I kind of want to put on my own show one year and I'd like to hear the competitors feedback about what would you like to win? Personally, if I do a show, I would want to win some money or a gift card to just a restaurant or something like that because all these like medals, are, some of them are so cheap and it's just like I did a show recently and the medal is just so cheap. It's like, I don't even want it. And, um, you know, I'd rather have like a gift card or some headphones or some bodybuilding wear, you know, with my supplement line, um, I, I work a lot of shows. I have a booth there and, uh, I give products to the overall winners. I'll give the promoter of the show. I'm usually friends with them about $500 worth of product to hand out to the overall winners just because I want them to try my product out because once you try it, you're going to love it and you actually get up there and you're like, oh, wow, I won this and this and this. I just didn't win like this cheap little zip up tote bag with a bunch of samples in it and a little scratchy t-shirt. Uh, I give uh, top quality t-shirts away. I give high quality my supplements away, which you know, I'm losing money, but I want people to try the supplements and like them since my company's still fairly new. But I love you guys out there. Hope you're doing well. Like I said, I have any comments.